the christening of Prince Louis, will be a lavish affair with classical music, silk dresses and expensive candles, at least if his granny gets her way. Carol Middleton thinks that a decent christening party should cost £2,000, and that's just for the added extras. The Duchess of Cambridge's mother sets out her top tips in Debrett style detail in her column for this month's Baby London magazine. Detailing ways to mark such an event, which she refers to with PC Zeal as a naming day celebration, Carol, 63, suggests creating a time capsule box and asking guests to place handwritten notes, photographs, or trinkets inside for the baby to receive on its 18th birthday. She recommends the bouncing baby wear something beautiful, such as a 125-pound silk gown from Monsoon, and must also be showered with luxurious gifts. Among her recommendations are a 49-pound and 95-pence English trousseau piggy bank from Harrods, a 265-pound Philip Herbert plaster cast of the baby's feet, a 125-pound Mimino leather memory case, or a 30-pound Steve Teddy. To reward guests for their efforts, the former air stewardess tells the magazine's 200,000 readers that they too should receive gifts, including votive candles, pretty chocolates and silver charms to take home. And playing a few old CDs simply will not do, Carol exhorts parents to splash out on a classical harvester singer who can charge £300 for an afternoon. And of course, no party would be complete without a theme. Carol advises buying Beatrix Potter teddy bears picnic decorations, and there are no prizes for guessing where from. She suggests her website, Party Pieces, is the ideal place for napkins and balloons. In February, Carol treated readers to a £1,500 mothering Sunday wish list. Lewis, who was born in April, is expected to be baptized later this month. After her ex-professor Green bitterly accused her of downgrading from him to a new love, model Faye Williams has responded with the ultimate kiss-off, getting a tattoo of her latest boyfriend's name on her wrist. Faye has made the bold statement despite only dating Dan Crow, a tattoo artist, for three weeks. Evidently she was in the mood to retaliate after the rapper, pictured with her, right, hit out on social media after their breakup last month.